history because <laughs> we can't leave without uh, doing the story of the everyman and we now haven't got time uh steve uh, the sculptor and artist uh says there's a gorgeous picture of steve's lovely mum oh i love it with eleanor rigby there you are Alison. it looks like they're having a good conversation isn't that a great picture? That's exactly what I was saying. That's a great picture. That, if that was in any of the national papers, they'd love that, wouldn't they? <laughs> and do you know what? His mum actually looks as if she's going to have a nap or two. Yeah, he does. They say people in Liverpool will talk behind, behind legs off any, anyone. Talk statue to life. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> see, that to me is off. Do you see, that's a great pose, though. Yeah, it uh, is. 100%. <laughs> to a star to steve's mom because oh, yeah. her expression yeah. is that she's chatting to eve she's done they the look like they're waiting for a bus and they're having a bit of a gab <laughs> yeah. before the bus comes along have you been waiting for <laughs> <That's a> great <laughs> photo isn't it stunning that's steve what a photo mm -hmm. I think that should have been put in for a little award. That. I think I, so, I, yeah. I, I love it. I love yeah. the composition of that. That, that has captured Hasn't it? everything I was trying to say yeah. about the people of Liverpool. You know, once we take anything to heart, you're a friend. And that, that picture depicts everything that I was trying to get across. Yeah. It's beautiful. Yes. It's made me smile, that picture. It has. It has. It's, it's wonderful. Thank you very much indeed. Um, so, uh, a final letter E. Um, the lucky, well, the electricity man. <laughs> the lucky man. Lucky. <laughs> well, we're not sure for a minute. Should we save that for L? <laughs> <laughs> I was amazed that I got escapologist out. <laughs> I was very impressed, well impressed with um, that. <clears throat> something you don't see anymore was when he used to come to the house. I mean, Anne used to use the meter like a, a, a piggy bank. You know, she used to just pile money in it all the time. And she'd put the echo on the table and so he could empty the meter. And then you'd watch him roll the, the ten pences up into pounds and into this little brown. It was, there was a, a real art to it, into these little cones of brown paper and put some tape around it. And then there'd always be a good tea, you know, 